the last time I came out here to film, a guy came out of here strapped with a nine millimeter. Okay guys, today I'm out here off of 30th Street in Canton at, again, what used to be a, uh, a Lawson's. And this one is huge. This one is really cool too because, well first of all, let me show you this. A lot of times they cover up the rafters and you can see them on this, which is a dead giveaway. But then I thought this was cool up here too, this old Martindale Wash Mart sign. I don't know how long that has been there but the guy in the little dart store here, darting around, he told me that, uh, that yeah, that was actually inside this building here. So I suppose it could have been that this was the Wash Mart and then this half was the Lawson's. I don't know, because I don't know that I've ever seen a Lawson's this big. I mean, it's usually, you know, from here down, but, uh, but this is pretty big here. This is obviously not the original Lawson sign because it's not shaped like it, but that's probably the original pole though for lease. And this is cool. We got an old payphone over here even though it's completely gone. <laughs> yeah, this thing's been completely ripped out. That's funny. Hello? Dial 33, free call for Ohio lottery numbers. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, so yeah, you can see on the side of the building where there used to be lettering. I don't think that said Lawson's, but that's where it would have said Lawson's. Huh. That's kind of interesting. I wonder what that did say. I'm going to have to look on Google, see if I can find an old picture of this, or maybe some, uh, you know, Google Earth go back for a while. But the last time I was here, and we're gonna take a peek in these windows in a second here. But this is one of these uh, 777 places that are borderline illegal, and actually they are pretty much illegal. The last time I came out here to film, a guy came out of here strapped with a nine millimeter, and he's like, what are you doing? I'm like, uh, getting out of here. <laughs> no, he was actually cool about it. But uh, the guy next door just told me that they were under indictment. Look at the floor in here. That is really cool. I don't know if they put that carpet in when they made it a, uh, you know, a gambling room or whatever you want to call it. But that reminds me of something you would see in a video rental store. I wish we could see farther up here, but there's too much of a glare. Eh, kind of. Huh. Yeah, I love that carpet, man. That's funny. And the rafters, that's just a dead giveaway that this was a Lawson's. Let's go around the, the side here a little bit. I went in and told this guy what I was doing so he wouldn't see me out here poking around and get weirded out. There's that sign though, that's really cool. Some fools over there raising heck. <laughs> yeah, nothing special back here, but... I wonder if there used to be another building attached or if there were steps going up to something there. A ramp or something. I love how you can even see the back of the rafters here. That's really cool. Yeah, it looks like there was some kind of a steps or something there. You can kind of see an outline. I don't know what it would have gone up to. It's obviously nothing there, unless there was like another, you know, path. 
patio or something connected here. I don't know. Maybe somebody who knows this place can tell me. Look at this. Huh. That's kind of interesting. Oh well. Yeah, nothing really to see around the side in the back there, but this was definitely an interesting find that I've been wanting to film for a little while, so glad I finally got to do it without getting shot. I'll tell you one thing, there's a pizza shop next door, it smells good! Oh, <laughs>